When we decide, when we didn't have, let me try again. Good start. To play games, we created games of our own. How's that? Better. <laughs> <laughs> Welcome to Game Dev Tycoon. Miss Business Simulation, you've been transported back in time to start your very own game development company right at the beginning of the PC revolution. In the next 35 years, you can build your dream company, create beer selling game. Best? Best selling games. All of the best. Only the best will do. Gain fans and become the leader of the market. Before you can your adventure, you have to give your upcoming company a name. I always just wanted to uh, come I to give if I ever came up with like a company or something, is what I wouldn't call it. Dynamite Toaster presents. Yeah, that works. Yeah, yeah. Player uh Nope. Jay oh Jackil. No, no that, that's a woman's name. So why don't you just put it onto a female character and just go with it? Because I'm a, because I'm a dude, I have a penis. Are you going to be playing the game with the, your penis? <laughs> and what bear is maybe, maybe if we do like a charity live stream. <laughs> I don't. If we could get a live stream doming and if we don't get a hundred dollars, you will expose your penis. I'm pretty sure that'd work. <laughs> now we've done thousands. Oh my god. Alright, let's just name it. I don't know. Should we be Jacob or should we be Will or should we be me or should we be that person? Why don't you just call him hey. Todd? <laughs> Alright, Todd. What's this? Oh my god, we can customize! So, Send the fuck back, we're gonna be here all day! <laughs> yeah, let's do that. Well, shit. <laughs> let's go red. That's not red. Oh, How about that oh, one? Yep. It's Todd's 2 d's isn't it? Yeah, I was gonna say. If you ever want to read the first, do that menu, text us up menu, that would be just some... It is good. Oh shit, we need to remember to save. Oh yeah, that whole Long with the Queen incident. I'm glad you remember, yeah. Incident. Congratulations, you decided to be game, don't come I remember your office in the garage and you're the only employee, but don't worry, make yourself a bit to start out this way. Let's start about your first game. Choose this measure and click anywhere on the screen to bring up the action menu. Hey! <laughs> That's very Sims. Before development can begin, you have to decide what kind of game you want to give and give, and give you a game name. You should also subscribe to the knowledge your game should use. Your options are initially limited, but once you have experience with the options, the game on pick topic, pick genre, pick platforms. Pick topic. Life, prison, UFO, government. Let's go UFO. UFO governments! Pick genre. A UFO. Um. What's popular? Huh? What's popular? I think what's popular. What's a popular choice? The genre? Yeah, what's likely to do well. The RPGs are complicated to start off with. How about adventure? Yeah. You can make a UFO pla pick platform. Um. PCs are still around. True. Dev cost 20k. Market ship? Yeah, sure. What's that game going to be called? Um. Alienic birth. I don't know. Hmm. Alien. Unidentified firing. And I did it. our first game. I unidentified kick ass object. Very Duke Nukem era. I like it. Yeah, yeah. Unidentified kick ass rock. Graphics. Text based 2D graphics, bruh. Yeah. Yeah. Start that development! Well, now we just sit here. Game developments run through three stages, being at each stage, you can see what areas of the game you want to focus on. Taking the right focus for a game greatly increases the points you generate. You want to improve the game and decrease the focus when you think less points. You want to really brief Alright. Engine gameplay. Um. I always think that gameplay should take priority over everything. That's true. Look at the original Super Mario Bros. Exactly. No, no, like, save princess. Done. <laughs> look at Double Dragon. It's literally the plot is, oh, look, they punched your girlfriend in the stomach. Let's fuck them up. <laughs> How about that, then? Uh, yeah. Whoa, whoa. Game development has now started. 
While the main game, you will generate game points you can see bubbling up. Game points are divided into three points. The more points you generate, the better the game will be. Nice. The main will also be bug points generated. Um, less ones you experience, so you fix ones the game. Then stage two for an identify kick ass object UFO adventure. Uh, oh, right, dialogues, level design. Artificial intelligence and level design we want. Yeah, like, like that. Looks good. Yeah. We're gonna end up with Magneto, welcome to die, levels of dialogue, <laughs> but it's all okay. Yeah, you can set additional features for your game, and you can open basic sounds for your options to increase quickly. Sound. No, we want graphics more than sound. Yeah, turn sound down a bit so we can put more into the others. How's that? Do you have any other choice? Yeah, okay. Alright. We've got a lot of research. Hmm, true. I might make sure we have to do that. <laughs> If yeah, the first game is not complete, you can press the button to finish your game, but you usually don't want to fix the majority oh. of the bugs. Reading everything's most completely effect green, so you shouldn't even consider if you need percussion kind of to wait. Oh, right, we wait around. That didn't take very bloody long. Well, that's probably because it's our first game. Bam, oh shit. Okay. The memory game is not finished. While the memory games you gain experience and improve your skills when the memory is completed, you'll be presented with a summary of the experience game. Well, this all seems okay. I, I guess so. <laughs> I don't think we fucked up. <laughs> Release game! Do it. Unidentified kick ass object. You have a You should see reviews and sales coming in for the game soon. Well, now what do we do? Unidentified kick ass object. Uh... Uninspiring Star Games. Adventure games work well on PC. Hmm. Falls a bit short. Dungeon. We fucked up. Fun at stages. That's not bad. Yeah, it's average. Adventure game invests a little bit of time in the distribution generates a game report. Okay, I might as well do that, I suppose. So, generate game report. Yeah. I don't know if I kick our subject unit sold, don't know. Yeah, I guess select. Dynamite Toast, a newcomer game industry, just released the first game. I don't know if I kick our subject. Game received favorable reviews. With such a good start, Dynamite no. Toast are sure to gain cool. fans quickly. Yeah, we did oh, it! Look, unidentified. It sold 2,000 copies. <sighs> Damn. You can sell you receive for game, game every week. You can sell all your game reviews by looking at sales graphs in the top of the screen. I don't ever care because I'm so successful, but we now have 16 fans. Oh, so that's more than that's. We have more fans on this game than we do subscribers in real life. That's the great thing about games. It's, it's ex, um, what you call it, escapism. <laughs> yeah. I suppose that's can I because I'm keeping. UFO and adventure is an okay combination. Gameplay seems to be not very important this time. Yeah. Hmm. I guess adventure is very simple. Game reports are available. Game research points. Space to generate a report for each game we release. Now, if you complete your first game, you know, it's time to look at the research menu. Mm -hmm. Oh, look, we've sold more copies this month. Sweet. We only have 11 We've oh, made a profit this month. Research is important to unlock your options. You try to save enough research points for your page to create your own game engine. This will be okay. Try to develop in different topics and try to slightly research boost. Um, we've only got 22. Oh, you 20. just. Hmm. What do you think? What where was this? RP. What, have we what do you want to research? What, what do I research? Oh, that, is that our research? Yeah, points? we've only got 22. Might as well do a new topic. Yeah. Don't have enough for anything else. Ooh! Ooh. Post apocalyptic! Ah, oh, I want to do vampire. Okay, post apocalyptic next time, okay? Alright. Vampire. Alright. Let's make vampire the masquerade. <laughs> that is a good. Ooh, we made six. Wow, we're doing well. Just from oh, our thing. sales are going down already. Well, we need to make a new game then. You said you can be a new topic. Vampire. Okay. Pick a time we made a new game. Pick topic. Vampire. Pick genre. Mm. Um, RPG? Summit Simulation. 
Yeah. Pick platform PC again. Cost less. True, but the more people yeah. own. Uh... We got enough. Yeah, we. I've got plenty. So. Okay. All right. Um, it's, it's a vampire simulation. Bloodlust. It's a, it's generic as all get out, but you know, they're not grading us on the title. Bloodlust, a vampire's afterlife. Excellent. <laughs> we can't cram much more generic into it, but you know. <laughs> uh, text Graphics. based. Yeah, that's relevant. Let's rock and roll. You make. Ooh, wait. Turn it down somewhat. I think this would be more story based. Yeah, it's a simulation game, after all. Yeah, yeah, so. Still. Like that. Yeah. Gameplay's gonna suffer, but. Go for something new. Yeah. Oh, we're still selling. We're still getting good cash for money from UKAO. <laughs> <laughs> uh, wait, right. wait, wait. Um, uh, dialogues be, is important. Oh, yeah. Artificial intelligence is important. Level design. Bit less. Yeah, does it? Yeah, not do. All right. Whoa, getting research points like a mouse. Ooh. Um, World design is need to be important. Mhm. Mm Graphic, not so sound. Yeah, increase the sound a little bit. That. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> this is fun. Yeah. And if uh. 61,000, you got a 61. I'm, I'm good with that. Yep. Of course it means we need, uh, wait for the bugs. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, we're not losing anything out of this. No, time. but if we wait too long, we end up. Oh crap, finish. Monthly costs. Yeah. <sighs> Bloodlust, the vampire's afterlife is ready. <laughs> <laughs> it is so Oh tough. look, we've gone up a bunch. It is so We haven't hit level yet. two on anything yet. Give it time. We'll make a few more games. The third game should get us a level two in something, by the looks of mm. it. Not probably in Todd. Alright, release game. I guess we wait now, don't we? Oh. Slowly outselling competitors in PC sector. Consumers prefer the lower price, great availability, and the flexible hardware configuration overall. Home. That's when we released this one. I yeah, don't it did. It. It's my spot in the competing hardware manufacturers. Oh, well, that's good. For us. Hmm. Here we go! Oh, oh no. I think we put too much, too little into gameplay. How do we do this? <laughs> Thanks, Game Hero, you dick. Abysmal. Um, maybe gameplay is more important than we thought. Yeah, don't say. Alright, generate game report. Yeah, yeah, Bloodlust of Vampires Afterlife. We spent 54 grand on this. <coughs> Who cares? We sold units. No. We lost a fan. <laughs> and another oh one. Oh my god! Well, that was a bad plan. Vampire and simulation. I thought that was quite interesting. Oh, simulations, of course, graphics are what's important. I thought we were doing good on graphics. How are we supposed to know what's a, what genres are a good match to what well, we don't. We don't make video games. I guess Maybe we, that's what research means? What can we research? Let, how about a new topic? Yeah. Oh, wait, wait, what about man, here we go. Uh, let's make a new game. Let's, let's do what we've got. Let's just do something generic for that all work. Okay, okay, okay. okay. Gov a government mm. simulation? Mm, how about prison? Prison strategy. Okay. On this thing. Yeah. It's going to cost a bit, but hey. And we'll call it... We've got to throw everything we can into it. This is our last dish effort. Jailbait. No. <laughs> no, let's not. Come on. Let's let's not. All right, all right, what, do you, what do you call it? I don't know. <laughs> Soap drop simulator. <laughs> uh, it's not a simulation. Don't care. How about soap dropper? Nice. <laughs> uh, 2D graphics? Okay. Yeah. It's gonna blow all our money on it on this game. This is our <laughs> last shot. Oh, okay. wait. It's, it's an action show. game. You want gameplay and engine more than quests. 
Yeah. Down the story quest a little bit more. All right, there. Um, yeah. Come on, we got this. We can do it this time. Uh -huh. We can make the best damn game. We lost another plan. Yeah, well, we're not gonna talk about it. It's a strategy game, so dialogue's other... a bit down. AI. Yeah, that's up. Up. Oh. Lower dry up dialogue. Try a bit level? more. How about level design? Yeah, that and that artificial intelligence are important. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I put dialogues down a little bit more. Mm -hmm. Okay, fine. Nintendo. <laughs> Dinky King. Nintendo is very known for what it's like, like a game, Dinky King. <laughs> That's funny. They had to drop him in somewhere. Not lost another fan. <sighs> We're ignoring it. Uh, wait, 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 wait. The prison strategy. Lower sound quite a bit. And put graphics um up. Yeah, that'll do it. Oh, if you go minus back. Okay. Well, we're nearly finished. Shit. Oh my That's God. the problem with bugs now, isn't it? Yeah, yeah. We, wait, wait. We wait. can hold out. Oh, thank goodness. <laughs> 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 Done. <sighs> yeah. Oh my God. This is getting stressful. This had better be good. We got a new record. <laughs> oh, good. What's that for? Um, new topic and new combo or something. Hello. <gasps> In world, world design. design. So our world design is going to be better from now on. Yay. Okay, release game. Come on. Yeah. Hold me! Oh no. Oh no. Oh, oh no! How did we do this? This could be the end, folks. Mm. <laughs> alright. You have such high fucking standards, you know. For a guy. Okay. This is alright. Alright, can I... Hmm. Let's generate a game report. What? No. No? We can't even afford that. We... we it costs to afford... To text to develop a new game. It cost. Wait, does it cost to bring out a... Yeah. How much does it cost? I don't know, but it does. How, how do you know? Yeah, because we haven't even got time. Let's develop a new game. Right, just let me... You take out. Let you me watch it. <sighs> But you're gonna, you gotta get their name. You gotta get their name. The six. I didn't want to put the Sims text-based start development. Oh boy. No, just get out of the work. But just for your story, I think I have potential. I'm in the conjuring business, and you can have your skills at yours. You want to catch me now? Okay. <laughs> Do you want to carry on with the six? No, I guess we are. Wait, wait, wait. Just let me do something. I think stories are important in a text-based game. I know what I'm doing, I think. <laughs> this me so much hope. <laughs> For Tez. You can design controller. Hooray! So when that starts coming out, that's what we want to develop for, because mm -hmm. we know history. <laughs> Wait. Dialogue is important for a text base. Yeah. Very important. Ooh, okay. <laughs> Hope you know what you're doing. I think I do. This is our make or break! Yeah, probably. <laughs> is that what is important in text base? Too late now. We're losing a fan from, from Soap Dropper. Wait, it's time to gain insights from me. Yeah. Okay, go. Hmm. Okay. Graphics is not important for us, text based. Oh, yeah, it's text based, isn't it? Yeah. So, so if I just do that. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Yep, yep, that's fine, that's fine. 
Okay, go. Huh? Creator of the game, Death Rocking, Rock the Finger Mitch, Prism Games. Ah, you're welcome. The very first game, it means lots of you enjoying it. We will post it for a little startup, so hopefully make sure we can bring more games. No. That was nicer than. Well, thanks, guys. You guys are awesome. You yeah. have made a good game. You've made a good game, we're just not very good at it yet. <laughs> give us a bit. Yeah. Don't give up on us yet. <laughs> Wait, the six. I think this is gonna work. You sure you wanna. I'm a... Sorry, I'm just like. Fucking hell, we leveled up in everything. Sweet! Except world design, because. Create a game of it. I told you. <laughs> Life simulation, it makes perfect sense. Oh, Thanks, that's... shit, for that. It wasn't as bad as. Right, watch this. Mmm! <laughs> oh, for fuck you. Huh. Eh. Uh, We're getting better. Uh, look, we, I got us a five. Yeah. They shouldn't oh. forget about and All right, I think we can look into game reports without having to cost anything. Can you say so? Oh, right, we can get more reports on each one. Because we haven't looked at Soap Dropper yet. Yeah. All right, all right, all right. <gasps> oh, crap, it does cost, doesn't it? Oh, that was monthly thing, yeah. wasn't it? Man, it lost us two fans. Shit. A person in this game playing what fun results. Life and simulation is a great combination. Dialogue seems to be not important. Okay. Really? Platform genre. Simulation match. on PC is good. Okay, so we can. Do you want to try again? Like do a new one, but with less dialogue. Yeah. Oh, should we? What about oh con, yeah. What about contract work? Wait, we should research at some point too. Yeah. What? We've got more money to do so. No, we've got plenty of points. And carefully, what contract you accept? If you miss a day for contract, you have to pay for a penalty. Fair enough. Fair enough. Play, help the playtest the game. Pay 14k. But we have to pay free if we don't. Well, that's fine, isn't it? Let's just see what else there is. Uh, library software. Develop a simple library management system. Yeah, let's do that. All 21k, right. that's a lot. I don't know if we're doing it or not. I think we are. Hmm. <gasps> Yay! Uh oh. Oh shit. Hmm. That's weird. Okay. Research. Let's just do what we can research. New topic, but that's costing. Custom game. Oh, wait, wait. oh shit, this costs research points, of course. Yeah. They said if we do it. Post-apocalyptic. You're on post-apocalyptic. I'm just thinking. If we put post-apocalyptic in action, that will be a good combination. So if we don't. And do, do we research? Oh, we, we do one or the other. All right, let's do post-apocalyptic. Yeah. If we can just make it into that. A post-apocalyptic text adventure. Do you think that would get us there? Hmm. Only one way to find out. <sighs> All right, let's try it. Post apocalyptic action. Actually, an action text adventure. How about adventure? Hmm. We're going generic, so let's. <laughs> it doesn't matter. Doomsday. Ooh, we can. Oh, you have to pay eight. But it's going to boom like a boss, isn't it? Ooh. Simulation strategy. Action adventure. RPG. Oh, right. Simulation does really we well on that one. Yeah. Okay, that's worth keeping in mind. So, should we, should we go for it? I think we have to. Text based. No, wait. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, fine. We don't have it's the money. Remember, this is an action adventure game. Engine is important. Story is important. Well, we can't do it like that because we have to sacrifice somewhere. Engine. Eh? Um, I say move story and quests down a bit more. Yeah, okay. I think the fact we're trying to have good sections in everything is one of the problems we're having. Mm. Dialogues lower the dialogues like hell. No, like even more. No, 
have it a tiny bit. Hang on, let me. Like, like that? No, up a bit. You do it. I think if we have dialogues like that, level design like that. But. Do you think that's okay? Uh, pff, I have no idea. I. We don't make video games. You keep saying that, but that's the point of this game, isn't it? True. Yeah, we can do it. Oh, right. That was it. Oh, yeah. <laughs> it just... Looks like I was trying to make it big in the game, game industry. The company's already published four games and is working hard on their next. In the interview, we found that the game is going to be a post apocalyptic adventure game. Some of the companies not done before. Three small companies in the same industries. All best luck to Dynamite Toaster. Awesome. Yay. <gasps> We've got hype. Doing a great game is not only for the best success. It's done to build hype to ensure the players are excited about your game. Six people are hyped. Oh. Uh, hype se Seven people are hyped for this game. Oh, I am looking. Okay. Wait, graphics up. Sound down. Well, design? Down a bit. Yeah. I think that's the best plan. Yeah. It's honestly hard to tell anymore. Yeah. I think we should research right. our own games thing afterwards. Yeah, yeah. Alright, but first... Finish it. <laughs> Alright, next time on last day point, let's see how well this game did. Woo! We'll just see the leveling up thing first. Oh, yeah. Here we go. Didn't do great. Alright, next time we'll release it.